Hello, Niall Keely here from Balbriggan Social Isolation Volunteers, Balbriggan Civ. Um, we've just had our uh, daily meeting today and um, I just want to update everybody on uh, where we are and uh, what's been happening. Um, I'll keep this one short and sweet, there's not, there's uh, has been a whole de a lot happening today. Um, well, the guys have been working extremely hard in the background and I really have to thank uh, Laura uh, Emma and uh, Ronan who are doing some sterling work today uh, but basically okay so what we're trying to do the main thing we're trying to get is the word out there that we're here and that we can help so um, I have been contacting various uh, local groups and organisations in Balbriggan letting them know about us um, I've been contacting uh, making arrangements with local businesses that um, we can work closely with so if uh, they need a payment solution or um they need uh <clears throat> just to know we're there um i've been doing that um i'm also because on, on our on our page i want to draw up a list of any business that is doing something differently because of the situation um maybe they're, they're you know they're they are open for business and they're doing it in a limited way or they're doing deliveries or whatever um so we're collating that information as well um so we've got some flyers out today and I just want to particularly thank um, Aidan in Merlin Press um, there in the uh, uh, business estate in Balbriggan uh, merlinpress.ie uh, they're still open for business you can talk to them online or um, over, the, over the phone um, so if you need any business cards or you need anything done wedding invitations anything, anything like that please give them a shout they're struggling but you know we know there's some there's work out there for people to do but it'd be great so uh, Merlin Press uh they helped us with uh, with some printing today and we're really, really grateful for that. Um, so, so do uh, give them a shout. MerlinPress.ie um, Also, Easton's in Millfield. Um, they were quite good to us today as well. They helped us out with some uh, some printing as well and some stationery that we needed. Uh, so that's really, really good. And um, we are putting out an appeal for, for different bits and pieces that we do need to help us get organised. Um, as I said, we're going to establish a couple of roles. Uh, gophers will be able out there to to do um, messages and uh, deliveries and collections for people, and we will have chatters as well. Um, people that will just touch base with 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 anybody that's out there that needs to chat or needs to talk to somebody or um, just needs a friendly face at the end of the garden. Again, really enforcing um, our own social distancing. But as I said. We can knock a door, stand well back at the on the on, on the path or whatever, and um, um, have a chat. And, and we're going round again in pairs as well as where possible. Um, for like, the the main thing here is, is safety and security and and anom anonymity. That um, you know, no one's details to be made public or anything like that. Um, so yeah, though, I just wanted to thank those few people that helped out today, and oh yeah, um. Yeah, people are a little bit reluctant to um to seek help. I, I get that. I understand that. I've had people coming up and they're apologising when they ring. They're apologising for the first ten minutes that, you know, I'm sorry. I'm sure I'm 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 young and healthy and but I'm stuck here with my kids. I can't get out. Please don't be afraid to call um or even just send a message or an email. If we we'll prioritise um what's important and what's not important or what's you know everything is important. But you know what I mean. We'll we'll prioritise um. What needs to get done first, um. But we would ask you if, uh, if if there's neighbours or vulnerable people in your area that you know of, if you could email us, um, or or, or call us, um, with their details, we'll reach out. We'll send two people, uh, that we that we that we know are, are, are safe, um, to call on those on on them and uh, make sure they're okay and arranged to keep in constant contact with them or let them know our services is there. So, um. Don't be afraid to ask us for help. We're here to help. We're, you know, it's it's a delivery service. It's a messenger service. Um, it's neighbours helping neighbours. Um, so please don't be afraid. Um, I had a lady on, you know, looking for um, just to, to get milk. Um, there's there's no problem there. If you forget to get something in your shop and you don't want to get it out again, um, there's no problem. So um, we're being as careful as as possible. We we may also need additional uh volunteers on the admin side of things and uh, to help kind of run the situation so if anybody's recently um become available and that have you know project management skills or 
Um, I they think we we could we could do one. Could you send a separate email to um, Balbriggan S I V at gmail dot com and let us know um, that you're there and able to help. Um, there's a few little um, jobs that needs to get done on the admin side of things. Um, we'd be really grateful for that. But otherwise, um, it's going really well and it's great to see Balbriggan, Balrothery and uh, Balscadden uh, have such good people um, that are stepping up to help out in this current situation. And um, it's really, 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 really good. Uh, so uh, thanks very much everybody that has stepped up to help. Um, that's it. And hopefully I will see you all again tomorrow.